I need a full report on what's going on out there, Captain. Easier said than done, sir. The Zerg are invading this planet. They've established a hive in the mountains. There have been too many Zerg attacks recently. The Dominion's still reeling from them. And this one's even worse. Admiral, do you see those narrow canyons? I can attack the Zerg as they're going through that area. The fewer that reach the base, the longer we'll hold. Good thinking. We'll set up an outpost for you here, and get some Reapers to cover the cliffs. I'll make sure they're equipped with spider mines. Use them wisely, and we can all get out of this in one piece. Understood. Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, we now actually have an equipment screen. You can kind of see some options that we have here. So we have the um, just the normal headgear uh, currently at the moment. And we got the normal tactical suit here. Uh, so we get more options later, do not worry. We also have a pulse grenade that deals up to 100 damage to friendly uh, grounded air units. Or you get the option of a flashbang which stuns and disables um, grounded air units for 5 seconds. And massive units and friendly units are immune. For this mission, we're sticking with the pulse grenade, as well as you have the option of the sniper rifle, which is uh, 125, dam 125 damage to a target enemy unit at long range, um, and can attack air and ground. Or you have the shotgun, which is a close range shotgun, uh, deals damage in a frontal arc, can use penetrating blast to deal 50, 100 versus light damage uh, to enemies in an arc. So it's basically really good against light, light ground units. And that's what this mission is kind of purely composed of. And also the damage that the shotgun does itself is like uh, 20 with uh, 40 bonus to uh, light. So it's like 60 damage to light. Uh, so there's a lot of actually good options. And for anything that you aren't going to deal with that isn't light, then there's going to be pulse grenades for that. So honestly, this is, I think, the best loadout for what you have right now with this mission. And so let's get going. Our position is secure. We're ready to head out. One more thing, Nova. Swan wanted to have a word with you. Yeah, I've been working on a jumpsuit that's ready for some field testing. You can't cloak in it, but it'll let you jump like one of those Reaper guys. Well, I can't say no to that. I've sent a distress call to the Emperor's fleet. We have to hold until his forces arrive. Well, Alright, so now we got a Reaper suit with Nova right here. I mean, now we can just go up and down close. It's actually pretty awesome, and I wanted to do that with the sniper rifle. Because that's like my dream, but the dreams can't be memes all the time. So we're going to be making primarily Reapers for this mission. I figured that was actually the best way of doing things. And we, we fill our gas actually immediately, because we're very gas heavy on this map. And there's also some gas here, some down there, I think. We'll, we'll just get it all. Okay, now we can start going over here. Okay, we're gonna just make a rally point here. Ah, there's your, there's your next gas. Because Reapers are a dead unit that require uh, 50 gas, 50 minerals each. So we're not even bothering with Marauders here, we're just doing like Marine uh, Reaper. And we, because we get spider mines with these guys and Marauders don't really get anything except for their little, little concussion shells. The Zerg are approaching from the north side. Be ready. Alright, so what I do is I hold position here, I put Nova down because she can tank, and then you just use her like a little shotgun blast. As you can see, she's extremely effective at these early waves, which is why she's honestly the best at this. We get some guys coming down here. We're going to be a little bit strapped from minerals, at least early on. But the rest should be okay. It's actually a lot of fun with the, like this is the only mission that Reapers are good on, so have fun with them, you know. The rest of them they're just fucking trash. Uh what's our next thing here? We're gonna Alright, we've got another pack of them coming in from the east. I do want to mention though that every mission is like this, that you you don't have any options for base building at all. You just have to kind of suck it up and, and just spend like an hour and a half fucking setting up uh your SCVs, you know. And I, and I actually hate it, so here we go throw a grenade at them. And Nova just kind of soloed this. Target's neutralized. Time to get ready for the next round. We have medics at the base if your forces need them, Nova. Hmm. I 
still need those reapers to set up some spider mines along the main paths. I'll use it later, but not now. So with the orbital command, you don't get to call down SCVs, but you do get a scanner sweep in case she has detection though. Right now, she's got the detection uh, ghost visor. Um, so that's not necessary, but you get the call down for extra, um, for these like little supply depots. And actually those are, that that is actually incredibly useful, believe it or not. Um, Cause you save actually a lot of money when you do that. And now we're making a, we're making an engineering bay. So, um, I mean, this this basically pays for itself after a while because it basically doubles the supply on every supply depot, and so that's how we go that way. So, banelings are obviously bad news for reapers, but that's what Nova's here for. There you go. Confirm that last. So she could just basically solo everything here. And you see, we're already like low on gas. I think there's a gas up here, actually. I'm gonna actually head for that one real quick. We're gonna start with damage first. Nova here. This is why we got the gas so early. Okay, let's get some more of this shit going. I'm gonna actually just make sure both upgrades are queued up so I don't have to wait. Insufficient Vespine gas. Another attack is incoming. Marking the coordinates for you now. Get this both of them going. And we're going to tell this SCV to actually just make an additional uh, barracks, but we're not going to actually make anything with it. Uh, we're not going to make an add-on for it. So Nova is actually the best for tanking this early on, to be honest. Hey Nova, looks like the Zerg are going after our military research center here. Some of my guys are still in there, along with all their tech. Think you can help them out? See what I, I want to make another uh, fly depot. Status report. All right, so we just send just Nova in. She blows him the fuck up, uh, and everyone goes in. If she's tanking, then it's all good. But she doesn't always tank. Clear, Swan. Oh, what a relief! Feel free to take that tech with you. It's yours now. I got it. Don't worry. I miss that shit a bunch. Alright, we can make another barracks actually as well. Because we have enough for that much. And we're going to go actually beside the medics here. That's the other thing about this campaign is you get nothing to help you build your base and you also get nothing to help you with healing your own units. It's fucking horrible. But you know what? It's a challenge. And that's what we're going to deal with. And this guy's going to come over here and make that right after. So there we have a plenty and plenty of supply. To go around. Now they're sending ravagers our way. Watch out for their corrosive bile. All right, now this isn't easy mode anymore because uh, the ravagers will use their little uh, stupid ass attack, like that that this thing. So you actually have to move your units slightly sometimes. Yeah, there you go. They're t they're taking a bit of damage. Let's go over here and kind of. There we go, we're good now. We did lose a Reaper somewhere in there, but whatever. Alright, let's get all this hotkeyed, and then as many as we can, and... There we go. Hey, you guys want to see an Easter egg? I'll show you guys an Easter egg. Now, if you scan a soup over here... Be on alert. The enemy is heading toward us. The Ghost and a Psymid are right here. Nova here. And if you're, if you're already aware of the story of the campaign, then you probably know why that's the case. Uh, but in case you're not... Um, it comes into fruition later. All right, now we're using spider mines. I'm reading you. On the move. Go, go, go. Got it. There we go. We got him. Got him. Now I can use this break to prepare for the next attack. I'm detecting some overlords on the cliffs ahead. They're bringing in more Zerg. Clear them out if you need to access those areas. Also, keep an eye out for any areas where you can build extra bunkers. We need all the support we can get. Acknowledged. Got something for armed We are gonna make some bunkers, though. By the numbers, oh, and we also have some gas over here we can get. That's pretty important. Loud and clear. I think there's gonna be one on the other side, too. 
bunkers just help to kind of take uh, to lower the amount of guys that are there. We basically, with as much gas as we can, we do build as much as we can regarding the uh, uh, regarding the, the reapers because they have the spider mines. That's literally actually one of the only reasons they become kind of like terrible later. But I'm saving a lot of the spider mines on them, which I shouldn't be saving probably that much. But uh, we'll just put it at the entrance here and over here too. You're not gonna believe this. Defilers are here. And they'll be able to shield other Zerg around them. Consider it done. I think they, I'm pretty sure that they count as, uh... Pretty sure they count as, a uh, light. Oh, maybe they don't. Business. Nova here. <laughs> On the move. Sec. And there we go. That's a nice attack. Uh, maybe we'll take out the rest of these guys. There you go. And there's like a queen that's coming around that we're going to take out at some point. Let's get some more reapers in. Additional supply depots required. Ah, I can't build here. The enemy isn't letting up. Prepare for another assault. Loud and clear. I'm reading you. Go, go, go! Execute. Say again. Oh shit, no, get down. Oh shit, that's not good. Get back. They completely did not jump down the right way. I just I don't want to get hit by the Ravager Bile shit. Alright, let's get healed real quick. Insufficient Vespine gas. I thought our experimental weaponry labs were far enough away, but now the Zerg's after them too. Don't worry, I'll be there soon. Are the numbers, boys? Where's our SCV? Huh? It's your time. Oh, allies. I don't know where he is. Alright, let's go deal with that now. Oh, these guys can come with us. I thought I had a Marine over here. Sure thing. Where is he? He's trapped in between these guys. Oh, there we go. Okay. Our allies' base is under attack. Okay, let's just make sure we don't get hit by that. Our allies are being attacked. All right, everyone's safe. And there's some equipment here. It's all yours. Uh, knew you could do it, Ace. Ace? Is he serious? Bad news, Nova. The enemy's launching attacks from both sides. I forgot which way they come from, but we'll just make a bunch of mines right here. Alright, let's get over here quick. Because this is the one that's not as... Base is under attack. Oh, they have Ravagers. I'm oh, sorry, that defilers. Our allies are being attacked. Fucking hate these guys. Okay, can we just deal with that? There we go. Uh, then we didn't lose anything. Insufficient Vespine gas. Yes, yes, we did. All right, now I'm gonna make a bunk over here. That last. And we still need a shit ton more marines, to be honest. I I have not kept up with that at all. Status report. We have enough reapers, at least. Insufficient Vespine gas. Uh, they're starting to kind of expand over here, so we'll go over there and take care of them. This is a nice thing that the this map is specifically designed for using reapers, so. Fuck. Kill these things. Where's Nova? Okay, she's not part of group one anymore. She's too good for group one now. Ultralisks are moving into attack. You better hurry. Engaging the enemy. Let's just take care of all these guys. Let's do 
Insufficient best beam gas. All right. Oh. Loud and clear. I'm trying my best here. Oh fuck, that was a band link. Yeah, unfortunately I can't hit that guy. Our outermost defenses are falling. We need reinforcements now. We've got something big coming our way. Hope you're ready. Alright, now with this, what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna lift off the barracks and kind of put them over here. It adds a bit of a buffer for them to kind of attack. Um, and, over here. and also with that, we're gonna bring a bunch of our marines also just down here. Status report. And there's always a very good reason for this kind of shit. This guy. So this should get rid of like a lot of the pressure, of course, as well. Yeah, this guy's gonna take forever to take down because we don't have anything that really chews through the armor. But he can't. He can't kill us all. And I guess uh, SCVs can come down as well. This is the final wave. Confirm that. I hope you're not still doubting my loyalty, Admiral. We all appreciate your aid right now. Now I forget which one they specifically come through for route. Yeah, the ravages are unfortunately going to hit that. Okay, let's uh, get some guys up here. They they've been hitting that that shit. This is the last uh, the last wave, by the way. I forget which way they come through, but whatever one that that you see them come through, just make a bunch of shit there uh, for mines, because I still am holding on to this many. Remaining forces are coming in for one last strike. You have to hold them off. Gangway, coming through. I think it's actually the top one, to be honest. I'm reading you. Base is under attack. Acknowledged. See, yeah, it is the top one. Status report. Let's get out of there. Is under Our attack. SCVs are under attack. Alright, let's uh, back off for a sec. I wish I had something repairing that. Oh, they like, they're very suicidal. Okay, we dealt with this one pretty well. But we, is this one's the problem. Admiral Horner, Terran battlecruisers are warping in above the Zerg's position, but they aren't the Emperor's. What? I don't like the look of this. <laughs> They're sending out a broadcast, patching it through. The Zerg have always been a threat, but today... The Emperor's forces have proved that they are too weak to protect the people of Boria. But the defenders of man are here for you. We will do all we can to safeguard your future. Admiral, they're contacting us directly. Let's hear it. This world is under our protection. Surrender the ghost and evacuate, or face the consequences. Like hell we will. Nova! Get your forces back here. They can't stop us from leaving while they're still fighting the Zerg. We'll have to meet the Emperor elsewhere. Yeah, for the life of me, I can't figure out how to... Like, Dominion Structures lost six, and it's more than five. I almost had this one. If I had held off the, the left side more, I would have gotten this one. But I've, I, I have extreme difficulty with this one, so... Oh well. We have just received a new report from the controversial Defenders of Man. They claim that more Zerg attacks are imminent, and Emperor Valerian has refused to take necessary actions to protect civilians. General Davis has supported the Emperor, while Magistrate Grayson says this could mean the worst for Valerian's regime. Nova. 
I'm glad to see you made it here safely. The defenders of man didn't make it easy. No, not for either of us. Yet if we work together, I believe we can stop them before they tear apart the Dominion. And your rule. I am not the man my father was. I wish to serve a greater good. I think we have that much in common. This ship is at your disposal, along with my covert ops crew. You will lead them. All I ask in return is your loyalty. You have it. I was hoping you'd say that. Rigel? Your new weapons and technology specialist. He has something for you. Our scans show that your memories have been altered, but it may still be possible to recover them. This device sends an electric pulse through your neural inhibitor. The process is unpleasant, but it can restore recent memories. I'll be fine. It's not working. I just keep seeing the city where I grew up. But it's destroyed. Covered in creep. I shouldn't remember it that way. I never went back after the Zerg attacked. Hmm. Or perhaps you did. Why would the Defenders of Man operate out of Tarsonis? A good question. Go there and find out. 